You may ask me why I serve the Lord. Is it just for heaven's gain? Or to walk the mighty streets of gold? Or to hear the angels sing? Is it just to drink from the fountain that never will run dry? Or just to live forever, ever and ever in that sweet old by and by? But if heaven never was promised to me, neither God's promise to live eternally. It's been worth just having the Lord in my life. Living in a world of darkness, excuse me. He brought me the light. Listen, I'm going to stop there because I'm getting too emotional. Why do I serve the Lord? Why? Because I spent my life hating myself. I spent my life full of turmoil, full of inner pain, full of confusion, full of fear. So many different fears. And I'm telling you right now, I was tired of being sick and tired. My life was empty. I was empty. My heart was empty. My spirit was empty. I felt worthless. I felt like a waste of time and a waste of space. I was a walking apology. I looked for love in all the wrong places. I played the fool. I acted a fool. I was a fool. And I'm telling you, being full of self-hatred, being insecure, having all kind of resentments and, and, and areas of unforgiveness, resentment and, and rage, God took me. He reached down into the cesspool of my life and he touched me, y'all. He touched me with his love and I have never been the same. I experienced peace and found out it wasn't a poetic idea. It wasn't an idealistic concept. It was a reality. I experienced peace, real life. I woke up one day and was excited about being alive for the first time in my life. Instead of feeling like the walking dead, I was alive. And I'm telling you from day one, to now, God has continually blessed me, healed me on my emotions, my psyche. He has healed my spirit. He has made me whole. He put me back together again. He taught me what real love was. He taught me how to love and appreciate myself. He taught me how to, how to love other people, not my way, but his way. He taught me what it meant to have wisdom, to have real integrity, to live in truth, to be honest and humble with your honesty. Listen, God is worth it if there's never, ever a heaven, if there's never, ever a hell. Some of y'all don't believe in either one. I don't care what you believe on that, but believe on Jesus Christ because he is the only way. He's the reason to live. He's the reason you're loved. He's the reason that you can be made whole. The only way that it can happen, not through a pill, not through a bottle, not by a lover in the bed. You're not going to be whole based on what some man thinks about you or what some woman says about you. You will be made whole based on the love of God. God, the power of his resurrection will raise you up and you will no longer be a dead man walking, but you will be alive in Christ in a way that you never dreamed of. Give him a chance. All that love you've been scratching and digging for, he's got it. He's got it. 
And I want you to consider giving your heart to the Lord Jesus Christ. I felt so led to do this right now. And I, it was just a spur of the moment. This wasn't even planned for this service. But it's on me to do this. And I feel like God wants each and every one of us to, to help people understand why we need Jesus Christ. It's not a religion at all. Thank you. 